today in Zachary's 3D prints news and updates. Creality CR6 SE on Kickstarter and also the Ender 6. Closer look coming up on Zachary's 3D prints. Hello, this is Zachary from Zachary 3D Prints, bringing you how to review news and other things you can do with 3D printing. If you're new to the channel and not subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. I will put every social media link I have in the description of this video. If you want, you can also support this channel as well. I will put the Patreon link in the description of this video. Well, the so the CR6 SE Kickstarter campaign has started. Creality's first crowdfunded 3D printer went live on Kickstarter two days ago. This campaign on Kickstarter went fast. The campaign is now over the 918% funded and is still open until the 5th of June. When they went live with this Kickstarter, they offered the first 200 pieces of the CR6 SE for a price of $269. And another 500 pieces for a super early bird price of 299 US dollars. The normal early bird price is 319 dollars. After the campaign, I think the price of this CR6 SE will be around the 400 dollars. So be sure and check out the Kickstarter link I will put in the description of this video. And also when you are buying this 3D printer, make sure if they ship to your country and also the shipping cost and taxes. So a little bit highlights of this CR6 SE. What does it have? It is an easy to set up 3D printer. It's easy to assemble and printing out of the box in less than 15 minutes, including bed leveling. Talking about bed leveling, it's leveling free. It levels the bed automatically going over the bed 16 points within a time of one minute and 30 seconds. So also motion stability, double profile Y axis and a double Z axis with timing belt. Yes, you heard it correctly. Creality add two stepper, stepper motors to the Z axis. And also a silent eight bit controller board because of the TMC2208 stepper drivers. Also a easy feed in extruder and also filament run out detection and uh, a 4.3 inch touchscreen. Check out the link in the description of this video for the Kickstarter campaign. Shipping is from of August 2020. So now we are going to the Ender 6. The Ender 6, the printer that is not like the others in the Enders series from Cryality. This is a core XY 3D printer that Creality is adding to their Ender series. And no, it's not like the Ender 5 or the Ender 5 Pro, which is a Cartesian 3D printer style. The Ender 6 is a Core XY 3D printer that can print very fast, with speeds up to 150 mm per second. Nice! And the printer is very precise too. Plus minus 0.2 precision. The printer has a stable Core XY structure and a quality printer nozzle. If you are thinking that you are, will get a very noisy 3D printer, 
No, completely not, because the Core XY 3D printer comes with the TMC2208 stepper drivers and a TMX2208 motherboard chipset. Is there a difference between that? I don't know. With power outages or other things that causes your printer to stop with printing, there is a resume print function. Of course, don't forget to press resume printing. You can assemble this Core XY 3D printer with ease because this printer is out of the box with all wires nicely arranged and hassle-free in assembly. Also, no problems with maintenance because the cables are not in the way. Something like we see by the Ender 3 and a stylish new user interface on the 4.3 inch display. And yes, it's a touch screen display. Nice. Yeah, well, maybe it is the price, which is unknown yet. Uh, but I do see those yellow springs. Nothing wrong with that. Those are perfect on my Ender 3 with the big leveling knobs. Why is this on the Ender 6? Maybe because to reduce the cost, to keep it as low as possible because the core XY printers are quite high in prices, around the $500 or $600. Some details about this 3D printer. The printer itself has a dimension of 495 by 495 by 650 millimeters and a weight of 30 kilos. It has a printing volume of 250 by 250 by 400 millimeters. Layer heights between the 0.1 millimeters and the 0.4. Online printing is via USB, I guess, and SD card. I think the normal SD card and not a micro SD card, which we see by the Ender 3, for example. And also printing material. I see on the side only PLA, but can it also print other materials as well? What are the temperatures of the nozzle? There is an option to order an enclosure for this 3D printer in acrylic glass. So you should be able to print something like PETG or ABS. The machine comes with a carborundium glass bed, which is almost going to get a standard Thing for Creality, so that is good. The site tells about different file formats like STL, 3MF, AMF, OBG and also G-Code. The last one you can put on an SD card and start printing. But the other, other files, you have to put them through a slicer and then you can start printing. So this printer is on the Creality website and there is no official prices known yet. I think that the prices are going to be around the $699, but the price can also be $899, which is possible. We will see. So to wrap up this video. So if you want to get the Creality CR6 SE with an early bird of $300, $19. Check out the Kickstarter link in the description of this video. Shipping in August 2020 and check if they can send it to your address and also pay attention to the shipping costs. And the Ender 6, the Core XY 3D printer, a new 3D printer in the Ender family. Welcome Core XY. Uh, with an option for an enclosure to print maybe other material other than PLA. Also check out the link too for an inquiry. Price is unknown at this moment. So we will see what that printer is going to cost in the future. And of course, you can also check out the Ender 3 version 2 on pre-order from July 2020. So also check that link out. And of course, if you don't want to wait on all those 3D printers, 
then you can also check out the printers that I have on the affiliate links in the description of this video. There you find all links to many other sites that I have mentioned in this video. So that being said, that was it for Zachary's 3D prints news and updates. Please like this video, subscribe to Zachary 3D prints and hey, let's make some fun with 3D printing. Zachary 3D prints. Bye bye.